Central Park is one of the most popular places to visit in the city for tourists and those of us who live here. Carriage horses have been a fixture of the area even before the park was laid out more than 150 years ago. But what will the future look like for the horses and the people who run the business? I do think it adds part of the history. I'm not a New Yorker. I'm not from here, but I visit here often a few times a year. It's always beautiful to see them. A debate about having the horses here has been going on for years. A video of a horse lying on the street went viral last month. Ryder was suffering from a neurological condition and was later found to be much older than the age requirement set by the city. He has been retired to a horse farm upstate. Carriage horse owners and the Transport Workers Union, which represent them, say the city could do more for the horses, more watering stations, hire a full-time vet again, and build a stable at Central Park. They now stay on the west side, about three avenues away. They, they Christina know, Hansen are, is a carriage owner and horse lover. There's plenty of space in the park. We love the horses. We love seeing them here in the city. You know, some people don't love seeing them in traffic. Um, they're actually very safe in traffic. The city has rules and regulations for the horses, what temperatures they can work in, living conditions, medical checks, and even vacations for the 200 current carriage horses. Opponents say the 68 carriage owners should be doing more. This is a bad faith attempt to continue doing what they're doing, to continue harming these horses, to continue putting all New Yorkers in danger with these horse carriages that are, are you know, just a menace. It's a menace to the horses. It's a menace to everyone in Midtown. It's 2022. It's time to evolve. A measure has been introduced in city council to replace horse-drawn carriages with electric ones. What's changed is we have electric horseless carriages now, which we didn't have before. So this makes a lot more sense. We love the horses and we don't want to just get rid of them and replace them with machines. The carriage horse owners and the union say their proposal is meant to keep the discussion going. The council members that have introduced legislation to bring in electric horse carriages are looking for more sponsors and then that bill would have a hearing. In Central Park, Greg Mocker, PIX11 News.